Hey, what's up? It's Christine Horn, and you are watching Actors Daily Bread. This is where I teach you how to crush your auditions, book more work, and live a life that you love. I am Christine Horn, professional working actress of 20 plus years and a life and career coach for actors just like you. Oh man, if this is your first time watching, put one in the comments so I can know that this is your first time watching. If you are an OG member, we've been rocking together, we go together, you've been watching me for a while, put OG in the comments. I'm live on Facebook, I'm live on Instagram. Hey Instagram, I didn't plan on going live on Instagram, but you know, it's like, it's a work with me Wednesday. So every Wednesday I take you behind the scenes of what my day looks like, coaching clients, going to auditions, prepping for my own work. So yes, I'm gonna dive into it today because I don't have a lot of time, but today I'm talking about three reasons why you're not booking. Three reasons why you're not booking. This is episode 192 of Actors Daily Bread. So if you have missed anything and you wanna catch up, come to my YouTube page. Link is in my bio everywhere you're watching this. Catch up on the 192 episodes. So all my replay watchers who will watch this later, what's up, replay watchers? Love you guys. So let's get into it today. Whew. Three reasons why you're not booking. And this is really fresh in my brain because um, lately, the past, since last week, I have actually been going to my own casting director workshops to keep myself sharp, to make sure the stuff that I'm sharing to my community is still accurate so that I can get into more offices. Some of y'all think, oh, Christine's been on TV, all this stuff. She don't need this no more. I do this stuff for myself too. So the things that I suggest to you are the things that I'm actually in the trenches doing here in Hollywood, which helps me book more. So let's get into it. Reason number one, and these are in no particular order, by the way, okay, um, is number one, you are not reading stage directions. I'm going to say it again. You're not reading stage directions. And I know some of you get auditions and the casting director says, don't read the stage directions. Don't be distracted by all that. But what's happening in that, during that, is that you are missing crucial information about the scene and crucial information about what's happening between you and the other characters. And so if you're not paying attention to that, that is going to affect how you're going to approach the approach the, the, the approach the scene. So if it says, you know, Jessica runs in frantically, right? But you start the scene just standing there and you start, you're missing the whole tone of the scene. You see what I'm saying? So it's not like I have to put on a full costume and, and have props and all kinds of things, you know, like, oh, you know what I mean? But it does mean read the full script, be connected to what is happening. If you're watching on Facebook, you know, with this new platform I'm using, I can't see any comments. So if, if there's comments, be sure to say hi on Facebook, just because I'm not sure if they're there, but you guys could just be at work and be quiet. No problem. Tip number two, and by the way, if you don't have my Get Booked playbook, it's totally free. Please get it. It's totally free. Click the link in the bio. If you're watching on Facebook, the link is above. Instagram, go ahead, click the link in my bio and grab the Get Booked playbook. So this is actually stuff that I use for myself, things that I pulled from my book, Playing Small. You can get it, get your hands on it. It'll come to your inbox immediately, okay? So just wanna make sure you don't leave without that. And let me know. I wanna know where you are from. Where y'all watching from? Hey, Dawn. Hey, Mina. Hey, Kenny. Right. Hey, Gina. Put put in the comments where you're watching from. That really helps me to know where you guys are and where my audience is so I can shout you out. So make sure you put your city or your state in the comments, even if you're watching a replay. OK, um, let's jump into tip number two. Three, um, we're talking about three reasons why you're not booking. And this is Actors Daily Bread. Welcome. Tip number two is you are afraid to go there. You are afraid to go there. What do I mean? That means you're holding back. You're holding back. You think, oh, I know it's just, you know, the script clearly says, you know, you know, Jessica, you know, is in tears. But I don't know if you think that was just a suggestion or you don't really have to do that for this audition. You'll do it when you get on set, right? And what I'm here to tell you is if you don't show us, if you don't show casting, if you don't show in your self tape or in person that you are capable of going there, how will they know you can do it? And so going there doesn't just, it's not just about crying, right? Or screaming or having rage. It could be about just being fully present in the scene, fully listening to the other character, playing, being fluid like water. Shout out to my client, Alvin, who had a great 
a really juicy callback today and I talked to him about being fluid like water. Don't be so stuck and I rehearsed it this way. This is how I memorized it. You know, this is what's gonna happen. And then you are not fluid. You gotta be able to go with the flow. Come in with your intention. Come in with what your objective is, what, what your relationship is to the character. Know who you are, know where you are, and then be prepared to fully go there. Whether or not the person reading against you is fully giving you um, a bunch of energy or not. You know, casting directors, they've been looking at people all day. They don't got time to give you 100% energy. Like they're trying to conserve their own energy. You know what I'm saying? So don't be afraid to go there. I shared with you, if you um, watch on IGTV, I shared my good doctor when I was on the good doctor on ABC this past season um, that actually got me, put me on the Emmy ballot, woo, woo, right? I shared that audition and I went there with the emotion and the angst and the turmoil. And many of you who watched the audition tape were like, Christine, you're when we watched you on actual TV, when we saw the episode, it wasn't much difference. It felt like it was just pulled from, from what you did. And the reason why is because I went there and I showed casting, I showed producers, I showed network, I can go there. You're not gonna have to coach me through it. I'm not gonna have to waste your time and money, right? Because time is money, right? And so if you can't show them that you can go there in an audition, whether it's in person or tape, and to me it's all the same, then they're not gonna be convinced and they're not gonna wanna take that chance because that may cost them too much money. You see what I'm saying? So don't be afraid to go there. So thank you. Hey, what's up, Columbia, South Carolina? I see you, Dana. Um, hey, Dawn in Atlanta, Mima in LA, um, right? Okay, so I wanna give you another, another tip today. So we're talking about three reasons why you're not booking. And if you don't have my Get Booked playbook, which is free, click the link in my bio to get it. You're welcome in advance. <laughs> Oh gosh. And listen, if you're not following me on Instagram, Facebook, I'm at actress Christine Horn. Follow me, especially today, because on Wednesdays, I do work with me Wednesdays. So y'all done see me this morning in my turban, no makeup, honey, braless. Well, I didn't show that. Y'all didn't know that part. <laughs> but we're taking you on the journey today. I have a very busy day today. So let me dive in. I'm on a time crunch. Last tip for today that I want to leave you with. So three reasons why you're not booking is you're letting the elements throw you. Hear that again. You're letting the elements throw you. What does that mean? That means you walk in the room. Oh, shoot, the camera's not where I thought it was. Oh, shoot, the reader's sitting down. I thought they were going to be standing up. Oh, shoot, I practiced with a chair. There's no chair. Oh, no, I have nothing to look at. There's four people in the scene. Who should I look at? You know, you're letting all that throw you instead of just being fluid. Hell, if there's no, if, ne if there's not extra um, things on the wall to look at, last night, shout out to Tiffany Little Canfield, head casting director at Chelsea Casting, I was with her last night and she talked about, hey, just look at me, just look at the reader. Never have we said they've looked at too many places and now we shouldn't hire them. So if it gets confusing, just look at the reader for all your people, right? So that's what's throwing you, letting the elements throw you because in your mind you rehearsed it this way and if it doesn't go that way, you are screwed, okay? So, um, Miss Tony, the audition tape is go to my IGTV channel. If you want to see some of my past audition tapes, follow me at, at actress Christine Horn on Instagram and click on my IGTV and you will see I have a series I do called How Did You Book It? All right. I got to go. I'm going to be back in a short while because I'm going to do a live self tape audit. I posted this for everyone to take a part of. Only a few people applied. So they're going to get that opportunity with me. Have an amazing day. I'm Christine Horn. I'll see you later. Bye.